Good morning. What's over there? Your passy? Okay. Here, you want to hold this? Hey. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, say hi. Hi. <laughs> Sit. So they can see you. There you go. Okay, now you can say hi. You want your slippy on? Okay, we got one Batman on. Do you know where your other Batman is? Put your passy. Good job. Can you put your babies in there too? Oh yeah. <laughs> no, you don't need that. <laughs> That's all the stuff you sleep with. Just put it right here in your crib. Yeah, in? <laughs> yeah, put it in your crib. Mommy put one of the babies. Ready? Look. One, two, three. Push. Good job. Almost there. There you go. Get it over. Good job. Okay, look. Look. Take this and pull it down. Oh, oh. We want it back. Oh, no. Here. Say bye-bye, baby. Bye bye baby, yay! Can you put your passy in there too? Yeah, passy, good job. Good job. Okay, do we need to change your diaper? Did you go poo poo? No, you need to clean? All right, where does those go? Look, these go over there, where all your cars are. Good job, someone broke your racetrack, or did you break it? Okay, look, one more piece. And if you guys are wondering why those are tied, they're tied because the kids like to hang on the curtains for some reason, and I don't want another curtain to fall down. It's not aesthetically pleasing, but who cares? No! <laughs> no, Bessie. <laughs> Can you put it back? We're gonna go downstairs. Put it back. Put it back. Put it back. <laughs> Put it back. <laughs> Good morning, guys, and welcome to today's vlog. He just woke up from his morning nap. I'm not gonna lie, it's already like 12 o'clock. I've been cleaning, doing laundry, and I feel like you guys have been seeing me clean and do laundry. But you know what, I do that on a daily basis, so it is a part of my daily routine. I don't know if you guys want me to vlog it always, because it's not like the most like fun thing. But that's what I've been doing this morning, and now it's time to cook lunch. Are you hungry? Do you want food? Show everyone how you can do more. Can you do it? Do more, show everybody. Show, say more. Oh, aw. But do this, show them how you know more. <laughs> now I gotta figure out what's for lunch and finish my coffee because I had not finished my coffee yet. I really wanna clean my pantry today, so yeah, I may do that too. I don't know. It's a big task, guys. It's, uh, it's a big task. Oh, we have to lock it because the kids like to sneak food. There's my pantry. And normally when I have a mess like that, I just, Shut the door. It's 2019 and I want to get organized. Oh, does that mean no more food? He does not like when I close the store. All right, y'all. This is a before of my pantry. It is a freaking hot mess. This is the number one thing that I hate in my house because it's so trash. Everything's just sideways. There's no organization. And I'm here to put a stop to that because I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it, but when the kids are done with something, they just throw it back there. First order of business is going to be taking everything out because this 
is a freaking disaster mess and I can't live like this any longer. So everything is coming out and we're gonna clean off all the shelves. The hard part is my whole kitchen is cleaned and now I'm going to make it a mess by taking all of this out. It'll be a good thing though. It'll be a good thing. Showing off. Don't wanna have to wait tonight. Wait tonight. Bets are off. I'm gonna find my way tonight. Wait tonight. Won't you talk to me? I are meant to be organized. This is after taking everything out. Now I have to wipe everything down and clean it all out. I will give a little disclaimer. We have a lot of things up here that need to be organized, but I'm gonna start and do this first because I, quite frankly, don't have enough room for any more things out here, especially the glass. So I'm going to now wipe all of this out and then I'm going to go through everything and look at expiration dates. Won't you talk to me? I want to hear your sorrow. Won't you talk to me? We'll make a new tomorrow. Won't you talk to me? One night to find the answer. Won't you talk to me? What makes this heart beat faster? Okay, I have wiped everything down and everything is cleaned out. This is all the stuff I have to go through. Holy mole. Holy mole. So much. Now that I got everything out, I'm trying to piece together things that go together. So like all the cereals in one place, all of the baking stuff, like to see how many sugars we have, to see how many flours we have, because I think we have an excessive amount. Every time we go to the store and we're gonna make something, we're like, oh, do we have enough sugar? Hopefully we have enough sugar. So we buy it and then we get home and we realize we do and we don't need a bunch of them so i'm trying to consolidate everything and that's what i'm doing right now i will tell you though my cleaning that i had done in here yeah it's going to What's this show that everyone's watching right now? Tidy, tidy spaces or something like that. And the saying is, if it doesn't bring you joy, you need to get rid of it. And I was doing this before that, but somebody had mentioned it to me once I started doing this. They're like, are you watching that movie? And I'm like, or that show? And I'm like, no, but yeah, this is the same thing. So do these tostadas bring me joy? No, they only make my butt bigger. <laughs> I'm just kidding, they aren't good anymore. <laughs> this 
You never realize how many home chefs or blue aprons you've gotten throughout the year until you see all of the recipes. We don't throw them away. We like to keep the ones. The only ones we do throw away are the ones that we don't like because we'll never make them again. But if we like them, they're in here. I love these baskets. I got them at TJ Maxx a while back. All right, y'all, after what feels like hours, I officially got it done. It's been one hour. No, I don't wanna say I officially got it done. I'm about 80% of the way done. I will show you the next couple things that I still need to do to it, but for the most part, it looks pretty bomb, not gonna lie. All right, y'all, this is what I have done. Once I'm completely done, which will be in a little bit, I will then show you where everything is, what everything is, but I still have these to do. I want to get one of those Lazy Susans, I think that's what they're called, and I want to put it back here in the corner, and that's going to have all of our cans on it. I have extra ones of these. They didn't make enough to put in an actual container. And then I have this left. It's the sugar, the brown sugar, the flour, the tortilla mix. I don't know what I wanna do with all this stuff or how I want it to look. I know they have those like larger things at Target that say the actual things, but I'm confused because like we have unbleached um, flour, unbleached flour, then we have bleached flour, then we have self-rising flour, so I can't put those all together. That will be a hot mess, so I need to figure out what's for what, and yeah, I need to ask Louie. We have a sugar, we have a powdered sugar, we have a brown sugar, we have tortilla mix, just add water. I don't even know if this is good. I need to ask Louie. But for the most part, I say it looks pretty good and I'm pretty impressed and I had a lot of stuff to go through, but thankfully the trash men just came by and uh, they took it all away. So I've been trying to do things as close as I can to Tuesdays because Tuesdays are a trash day. So either I can have it done ready for them or it's the next day because I don't want to fill it up too much where we have stuff overflowing. You know what I mean? It is cold outside and I am redefining business casual right here. I'm in my robe, but I'm also in a button up. This is when you know you mean business, but you're also needing to be extremely comfortable. So, thought I'd share. I just put Lincoln down for a little snoozer and I decided to take the kids outside. They needed to get some energy out of their system because they're really, really hyper. Whoa, you're so fast. He's so fast. She's so fast. Two hours later. Unfortunately, they only had one Lazy Susan and it was literally this small for 11 bucks. And no, that's not what I want. I want a big one. So I'm gonna have to order it. So I'll stack my cans and tell you guys when I'm showing you guys everything where the Lazy Susan will go. But yeah, no. And then I got these from Target for the flour, the sugar, and all of it. They had really cute ones that I'm sure everyone has seen that says like flour and says like sugar. But I wanted one for brown sugar and the powdered sugar, so I got the ones that didn't say anything. Flour is gonna be in this one. Now we have two. Mommy, you have to spread it out. It's okay. Two of them are gonna go in this one, okay? Just give me half of Guys, this one's really hard to get off. Is it thick enough? It's like, ooh. oh, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, these two bags, you're gonna fill in that. So let's start with this bag. Good job. This is your task. Whoa! Good job. Very, very different. Okay. <laughs> Can you okay. have them? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Wow, these are empty. All right, one done. This looks good. What Next is one it? is the sugar. Mom, what are you tacos tonight. Excellent. All right. Mom, what's in it? Oh, that's perfect. Is it? So here is the final product with all of them. I think they look amazing and now I'm gonna put them away. I am going to show you our new organized Good. pantry. I can deal with that. This is the best you're gonna see it Maybe for the next 30 years? Five months. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. 
Harder with floors. Literally. I did it with mommy. A really good helper. Oh, you're so slow. Oh, you're so slow. Oh, you're so slow. She keeps hitting herself, though. All I have to do is push a button. And you get a nice, fresh chip. A fresh nap. A fresh nap. I don't have to. This is amazing. And we are going to start baking and making. What do you think of these? Do you like these containers that you can see everything instead of having a million bags? Oh, you know, it makes my life so much better. Everything is so organized, babe. It helps. I, I didn't feel like I had OCD until just now. And I'm like, wow, I don't have OCD anymore. Yeah, look what I can do. Look what I can do, Dad. I can Camden do has his knee pads on. Okay, but Dad. I have to show you something. No kids can see this. Babe, babe, babe you here. have to line this up nicely. That's what I was teaching the kids all day today. Oh, wow. Before I show you guys in our pantry, I need to show Lewis something really fast. So I'm gonna lock him in the closet really fast. And I'm gonna put this right here. Babe, this is a great makeout session. Mm. I'm just kidding. But over here, behind, where they Ooh. cannot see, this is what we like to call <laughs> What are you doing? What are you doing? You get what I'm saying? What, what is she doing? I just wanted to kiss him in the closet. Uh, what? what? No kissing. No, 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 no. no Don't kiss go sit down. We are having taco night. Taco, 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 taco night. All right, y'all, we finished dinner, and now I'm going to show you a tour of my new pantry. Showing off. Don't want to have to wait tonight. Wait tonight. Bets are off. I'm going. All right, so we start here. I absolutely love these canisters. I'm so glad we picked them. This is flour, then sugar, powdered sugar, then brown sugar. Then in this thing, I have all of our popcorns. And here is all of like our baking stuff, but then it just has like miscellaneous like peanut butter. We have the syrup, all of the olive oil, the Crisco's back there, all of that stuff. And we come down here, and I have the stuff that I don't like to refrigerate, so all of these. Then in this, I have the taco seasoning and all of like the gravy, all the little packets like this. And then right here, I have a little thing of Jello, yeast, food coloring, all of that good stuff. Behind here, this is the goods. This is what I want to hide from the kids, hence why it's over here. Then we have the canned goods and all of the, that jazz. We have the cereal. I actually have one more of these. I just don't know where it is. And then all the breakfast stuff. So we have breakfast bars. We have bars. We have the flapjack in a container. We have our oats right here, just like breakfast goodies. Then we go down here. And these are just some of the snacks that I like to keep in the containers. These are some more snacks that the kids can pick up and easily get. Some flower seeds for daddy. Trail mix. Pringles. Over here is our bread and our tortillas. Over here is our pastas. So this is just like the kids mac and cheese. Instant lunch. Then we have tostadas and, or tostadas and tacos. And then just some Spanish rice and Velveeta stuff and then some lasagna pasta Then you go down here. You have the napkins paper plates juices They only have this for school lunches other than that. We don't give our kids juice. This is some puree watermelon flavor Louis supplement stuff some more water. This is the water Louie likes to drink. This is the water that I like to drink. That is our pantry and it looks so organized guys. You don't even know how good I feel about this. Tomorrow I'm gonna do up there because now that's 
driving me crazy. I hope you guys love our fresh, clean pantry. It like makes my soul feel so much better because I hate clutter, but this is the first place to get cluttery because the kids just tend to throw things or I'll get home from the store and just toss things in here. And I love to see like everything in front of me, not have to go behind things to see what we have or what we need. And this feels clean. 